Hi, I'm Sarah. I'm one of the reserves officers for Surrey Wildlife Trust. Today we're out with our regular volunteer group on Brentmore Heath, restoring some bare ground scrapes for the Heath Tiger Beetle. The Heath Tiger Beetle right, is so only found in the southeast of England, so it's really important that we protect this area for it. Our volunteers have been working very hard today to clear back these scrapes to restore the areas of bare ground that were naturally found within heathland habitat. As the heathlands are man made habitat, we have to keep recreating these processes and um, ensuring that areas of bare ground stay there for this heath tiger beetle that relies on the bare ground. This is one of the scrapes we've cleared here today. It's um, This scrape is smaller rows to recreate old tire tracks or um, animals that would walk and create like trodden pathways. This is an example of a larger scrape we've done on Brentmore today. This is a great area because um, it's got such sandy heathland soils that the um, heath tiger beetle loves. It will lay its eggs on the sandy bare ground which will then when they hatch the larva will burrow down into the ground. The larva will live in there for a couple of years and um, will prey on any insects that walk past the burrows. The heath tiger beetle when it comes into its beetle form will also hunt across the sandy bare ground. I'm Charlotte from the Species Recovery Trust um, and I'm here today to help with Surrey Wildlife Trust's work for the heath tiger beetle. The Species Recovery Trust are working on a captive breeding project for the heath tiger beetle and our aim is to try to reintroduce them at some point in the future and this site it would be a perfect place we think to reintroduce the heath tiger beetle. There is a population here um, but it, it's critically small so we think if we can reintroduce some beetles in the coming years we could really help to um, build up this population and for it to become you know really established um, and work the work that's happening today is just really fantastic because it's it's really helping to improve the, the habitat ready for that potential reintroduction in the future.